7 Best Compact Cars 2023 2023 McLaren Artura The McLaren Artura supercar harnesses plug-in hybrid propulsion to deliver almost unparalleled performance. Some exotics out there are more practical daily drivers, yet few can match the drama of the Artura swing-up doors and electrifying acceleration. The McLaren Artura is a two-seater vehicle that comes in four trim levels. The most popular style is the Tech Lux Coupe, which starts at $246,900 and comes with a plug-in hybrid 3.0 liters V6 turbo engine and rear-wheel drive. This Artura is estimated to deliver 18 mpg combined. From its aerodynamic exterior to the no-nonsense cabin styling, it's clear the Artura didn't show up to the same sculpting classes as Ferrari or Lamborghini. Instead, McLaren's brainpower went into delivering the most memorable driving experience this side of an F1 car. Crafted from a carbon fiber tub and stocked with cutting-edge driving tech, the Artura's 671 horsepower engine and handling characteristics are configurable, and there's a healthy kick of electricity lurking within the rechargeable 7.4 kWh battery pack. twenty twenty two Maserati MC twenty. The Maserati MC twenty is an Italian supercar with extraordinary acceleration and handling. Steep prices and limited production numbers make the MC twenty a true collector's item. The Maserati MC twenty is a two seater vehicle that comes in one trim levels. The most popular style is the coupe, which starts at two hundred fifteen thousand nine hundred ninety five dollars and comes with a three point zero liters V six turbo engine and rear wheel drive. This MC20 is estimated to deliver 15 mpg in the city and 25 mpg on the highway. With head turning good looks and more performance than you'll ever need, the Maserati MC20 is absolutely what you'd expect from a sleek Italian supercar. Sitting just behind the passenger compartment is a 621 horsepower twin turbo V6 that provides seat pinning performance. 2023 Mercedes-Benz EK Sedan Mercedes-Benz entered the EV market by starting the EQ sub-brand, introducing the EQS sedan last year with great success. The EQS is essentially an all-electric version of the iconic Mercedes S-Class flagship and the follow-up, the new EK Sedan, is a mid-size version. Even though it's smaller and less expensive, the EK packs a mighty punch and is an excellent choice for buyers seeking green luxury. When the 2023 Mercedes-Benz EK goes on sale later this year, it will be available in four trim levels, starting with the base EK350 Plus and climbing to the high-performance AMG EK. In regard to the all-important range question, the EK is estimated to return up to 400 miles on a charge, but that figure still needs to be verified with real-world testing. There's also an EK SUV on the way, just in case the naming isn't confusing enough. Our initial impressions of the EK are very favorable as it delivers all the luxury expected from Mercedes, along with potent performance and loads of technology. 2023 Mercedes-Benz C-Class The 2023 Mercedes-Benz C-Class has been completely redesigned, and the result is a true European driving experience with many features that echo those of the formidable Mercedes S-Class. Once considered the baby Benz, the C-Class is now solidly part of the Mercedes lineup. The Mercedes-Benz C-Class is a five-seater vehicle that comes in three trim levels. The C-Class is rear-wheel drive with 4MATIC all-wheel drive available as an option. The turbocharged mild hybrid engine delivers virtually the same output as the competitive BMW 330i. That's more horsepower than the base engine in the Audi A4 and Cadillac CT4. Among this set, all but the A4 are rear-wheel drive vehicles with optional all-wheel drive. 2023 BMW M2 The redesigned BMW M2 promises outstanding performance thanks to huge horsepower and an aggressively tuned suspension. A tight cabin and a hefty price tag are the only reasons to consider alternatives. The BMW M2 is a four-seater vehicle that comes in one trim levels. The most popular style is the coupe, which starts at $63,195 and comes with a 3.0 liters i6 turbo engine and rear-wheel drive. This M2 is estimated to deliver 16 mpg in the city and 24 mpg on the highway. From the outside, the new M2 stands out with its blocky styling cues in the front and back. The jarring design choice seems out of place on this coupe as well as throughout the BMW stable. Looks notwithstanding, 
This M2 promises improved overall performance thanks to a new twin turbo inline 6 rated at 453 horsepower. twenty twenty three BMW i four. Exciting, innovative, and a window to the future, today's electric vehicle revolution is a wonderful moment in time. But, real talk now, it's turning out some ugly cars. Sure, style is subjective, but one of the most appealing traits of the twenty twenty three BMW i four is its shocking normalcy compared to its hyper styled peers. But for the badges and a few aerodynamic bits, the i four looks like the sleek four door BMW four series Grand Coupe. It even shares the same basic dimensions. Finely tuned suspension and steering settings, plus a low center of gravity, give the i4 the sporty and agile handling for which BMW is known. But with 335 horsepower in the base trim and up to 536 horsepower in the high-performance M50, the i4 vaults over its gas-powered counterparts in speed, performance, and instant low-end power. 2023 Audi RS3. In the world of Audi sedans, the most powerful and driver-focused among them are the RS models, and the Audi RS3 is the most affordable ticket to this elite club. A 401 horsepower engine and advanced suspension provide the RS3 with speed and handling to give supercars a run for their money. The Audi RS3 is a five-seater vehicle that comes in one trim levels. The most popular style is the sedan, which starts at $61,995 and comes with a 2.5-liters i5 turbo engine and all-wheel drive. This RS3 is estimated to deliver 20 mpg in the city and 29 mpg on the highway. Audi's dual-clutch transmission provides seamless gear changes without the technique or patience required for a stick shift. Inside the cabin, passengers have all of the comfort features and infotainment they want for the daily commute, and there's a usable back seat, unlike in most sports cars.